Hello everyone, my name is Allie and today I'm going to be going over my TBR for the one readathon to rule them all. If you missed my announcement video, this is a readathon that I'm co-hosting with a few other people. It was created by Ashley over at Don't Have a Degree in Reading. I will link my announcement video as well as all of my host channels and announcement videos down below. But of course, uh, the one day I finally have to film, or the one day a week now that I have to film, I wake up with a horrible sore throat. So I'm going to try and keep this short and condensed. So the first book on my TBR is The Obelisk Gate by uh, N.K. Jemisin. This is the second book in the Broken Earth trilogy. This covers a few challenges. This covers the POC author challenge, the POC main character challenge, as well as the LGBTQIA plus representation challenge. Again, I'm not going to go into depth about what these books are about because my throat just can't handle it today. The next book on my TBR is The Slow Regard of Silent Things by Patrick Rothfuss. I can never say this. The King Killer Chronicles. I don't know why that's so hard for me. This is the novella for the King Killer Chronicles series. <laughs> This completes the challenge of read a fantasy book under 300 pages, and I'm pretty sure the recycling truck is right outside of me. Shit ton of noise. Go away. Go away. Thank you. I think it clocks in at like 190 or something like that, so I should have no issues getting through this. The third book on my TBR is The City of Brass by S.A. Chakoborty. I think. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. This completes the challenge for reading a fantasy book that takes place in a non-European setting. This book takes place in Egypt, and I think the entirety of it takes place in Egypt or in that area. So I'm really excited about this. I've heard really, really great things, and I've been dying to get into this. The next two books on my list I don't have in physical form yet. I ordered them off online, and they just haven't arrived yet. The fourth book on my TBR is The Last Wish by... Oh, I can't, I'm so sorry if I say this wrong, but An Andrzej, Andrzej, it's a Polish name and I don't know how to pronounce it. This is the first book in the Witcher series. Uh, I've heard of the video games, and I, but I haven't played the video games, but I, I've been wanting to read the books before I try and play through the video game series. But this, because the author is Polish and the works were originally written in Polish, this completes the challenge for read a book that was written by a non-English speaking author. If you can't find an, uh, an author for this challenge, we have agreed amongst the hosts that it's totally okay to read a book that is by an author whose first language wasn't English. So if they're from another country and they learned English as a second language, then that's totally okay. And the last book on my TBR is Jonathan Strange and Mr. Norrell by Susanna Clark. This will complete the challenge to read a book that is a thousand pages or longer. And I'm going to be reading this as well as listening to the audiobook for this and kind of going back and forth between those two mediums because it is long. And if I'm going to come even close to finishing a thousand page book in two weeks with my new schedule, I'm going to need all the extra car traveling time, audiobook time that I can get. <laughs> but that is all that I have for my TBR for this readathon. If you're having trouble finding books for any of the uh, challenges, please watch all of the other hosts' TBR videos. I'm sure they will not only give recommendations through the books that they're reading, but I'm sure they'll mention other books as well. And I will also link down below our resource sheet that has a bunch of books that will fit different challenges. And I'm going to attempt it. I might be biting off more than I can chew. But I will try and vlog for the two-week readathon. Uh, it's a little over two weeks, so I'll like do a one week and a few days vlog and another one week and a few days vlog and post those at the ends of the first and second week of the readathon. But we'll see how that goes. I'm not a well-seasoned vlogger, so uh, we'll, we'll see how this goes. But I will attempt it. I can't wait to start this readathon. Please check out our Twitter page. I will leave all the links you will need to know, and hashtags, all of that stuff down below. Please let me know some of the books that you are planning on reading in the comments down below, but until next time, happy reading, and I'll see you all then. Bye.